Hey guys, it's the Cardist, welcome back, and in today's deck review, as someone actually emailed me and said, why don't you do any crazy deck reviews anymore? So I thought I'd do a very unique deck that has, actually hasn't been reviewed on YouTube. Now, you can pick this up from murphysmagic.com, check them out, it's such a nice deck of cards. It's basically a bicycle rider back themed deck, but it's called the Bicycle Metal deck, so it looks just like metal as you can see. Now, a bit of background information on this deck. Now, this deck was printed um, in the first series, a very first series called Texture Series by Max Playing Cards. You may uh, know about that. And also, it has there was 5,500 decks printed, and I I have the 2000 and 2004 deck. It was printed in 2014 by the USPCC and it's also uh, in partnership like basically the ones that produced it and distributed it was collectible playing cards and also it is a standard finish, standard stock, so bicycle uh, air cushion finish and a bicycle stock and also it has a silver foil embossed tuck case. So let's head on into the tuck case and let's have a look straight away at this deck. Okay for you to actually see this deck I've had to turn the brightness up because it's such because it's so silver, the light makes it look really, really dark. So I've actually had to turn the camera brightness up. So if it's a bit bright, it's only so you can actually see the deck. But as you can see, it has the bicycle ace of spades embossed here. Just, I'll quickly, whoops, uh, let's see if I can grab you a close up. You can see it is the original Ace of Spades that's normally on the deck, and you can see where it's been embossed. It has Bicycle and Burgundy there, and it has Trusted since 1885, and it has Metal Deck, and it has Playing Cards. On the side it has, uh, it says Magic Finish, uh, for some reason on the website it did say it as Standard Finish, um, so obviously it's a Magic Finish then, uh, my mistake, and it has Made in the USA with the Ace of Spades just there, and it also has these screw marks there, there and there. On the top it has Texture Series, okay as you can see it has like this, it looks like it's on a metal plate, and as you can see it's on the side as well with like the metal plate. It has Metal Deck by Max with the like metal pins there, and it looks like it's embossed. Then it has Max playing cards and it has the collectibles logo with some copyright information just there at the bottom. And then you get the back design and as you can see it's just a standard rider back but in silver and it's embossed and it's quite crazy the back design there. As you can see they have done a ton of embossing with this one. Then you get as you can see the sticker seal is also silver and as you can see it says 2000 or 5500 decks. Uh, and it has the USPCC, and also on the tab it continues with the red there with like the spade, diamond, club, and heart. But all around, it's a very, very nice deck, and I'll show you if I turn the brightness down, uh, it does look quite dark. So when you do, it does help when you actually have the brightness on. But it's a very, very nice deck of cards. So let's have a look what we actually get inside the tuck case. Also on the tabs it actually comes with a 7 of clubs reveal and that is just a bonus as well. So you get two reveals for the price of one. So let's have a look more into the deck. Okay and then you get the deck and as you can see straight away it has a silver border. Now it isn't actually printed on silver foil and it is actually a mirrored back. So what that means is if I turn this around and I give it a thorough as you can see it has the back design does not change but what I also like is you get different shading so as you can see it's quite light on the side then it's dark at the top with all the scratch marks and it looks like a panel as you can see it's all metal and it's just the bicycle so really really cool and it really really does go with the metal theme straight away I'm really digging this deck but then we turn it over and as you can see all of the cards are also got metal as well and they all come with the screw marks there and it all comes with the grey and the shading so what this means is because it's shaded and lighter on one side if you fan it like so you can see to get this different shade but then if you uh, fan it the alternative way you get a different shade here so it's actually quite unique for that part then you get a few things so first off you receive a double backer that's quite standard with decks nowadays and then also you receive metal deck and it has max playing cards and it has texture series so first off you receive that and it's on like kind of that metal you know when you're going like some certain stairs and stuff have this material aluminium and then you receive two jokers and with this dark theme as you can see it's a paper clip and it has joker joker 
and it's like in metal with these screws in the corners and one's just a paper clip and then this one actually has a five of diamonds reveal straight away you get to reveal the jokers and that's what I like straight away then you get a custom ace of spades thank god there is actually a custom ace of spades it has bicycle 808 with the texture series there made in the USA in metal with like the kind of uh, screws there there and there that looks like it's been 3D put on and it has bicycle 808 and as you can see the pips also they're actually like the bicycle standard but they've actually customized them and it's a completely kind of custom kind it has the pips there and there with the metal pips with also the dark kind of metally themed background and you can see it goes the whole way through and it's exactly the same and I dig this because it's different and it matches the theme it doesn't just stop even the royalty as you can see they've actually customized it it's customized there with the colorizations the metal pips and also the royalty having actually changed they look more metally and they're more blue and then you get four custom <laughs> sorry then you get four custom aces, and the diamonds are very different, quite chunky, they have these little holes in them. Uh, as you can see, it goes the whole way through, even with the pips here, with the rest of them, you have these little holes. And even with the Jack, Queen, King, the same colorization as the spades. And also the same with the clubs as well, uh, but the clubs look a little bit more chunkier, and they have a black stroke around them to make them more pop away from the metal. And then you get a big, giant club. That, as you can see with like, the metal effect they're doing there and it's exactly the same with the hearts but the hearts look a little bit more kind of um, as you can see a little bit more shinier and they look really really 3D but such a cool deck the artwork on this deck is really really good and I'm not complaining on the artwork at all such a great deck for artwork it looks so nice because it's a different style of deck we're all so used to just bicycle standard decks so when a deck comes out and it actually states metal deck and when the tuck case is so foiled up that the camera struggles to pick it up that's a deck that matches the name for me but this deck can be all that but let's see if that magic finish actually will help this deck okay so let's have a look at the handling of the deck so first off as you can see the dribbles of the deck are really really nice they don't tend to slip as much as I thought they would because I thought this deck's got so much ink on it and I thought it would be a struggle but as you can see it has no problems and I haven't had any signs of chipping yet so that is a bonus. Then we can do a spring. As you can see with a spring, it does a really, really nice spring. There's no problem there uh, with the stock and the magic finish. Now with a fan, it looks really nice if you fan it just this over out the pips because you get these nice little screws. But you can see it has this kind of lighter pattern there. And then if you do it that way, it gets a lighter pattern. So you have two different ways to actually colorize the fan there. But really, really nice. The pit layout as well, I'm uh, digging. But then we can do a triple shuffle really really different and unique such a cool deck I'm really liking this one for some reason it's growing on me quite quickly as you can see cuts as well is really nice and you can do flourishing with this deck it has no problem pulling that off you can also do Charlier cuts and car productions obviously what I like about this is if you turn one over it's a little bit hard to tell um, because obviously the back matches the same color as the front but then a color change as well it pulls that off easy as well now we can do a ferro and we can do a giant fan and look at that for a deck that's actually completely unique in the way of the name and the back design and the colour obviously it's a bicycle back but the way that they've changed it it's just made it into something new and different and unique and I would like to see more of their texture series really really good I like this one so let's get into my overall opinion of this okay so my overall opinion on this deck is this deck is awesome now the only fact I'm saying this is because I'm usually not a big fan of all these make, like big custom decks that say it's like wood themed and then it just looks crap. But this one actually looks really really good and I think it's because it's not such an expensive deck for what you're getting. For example, the, the design work on this is incredible. The silver foil actually looks like metal and they've actually taken time and care to make this all look like a proper kind of standard. Like It's meant to look standard and it's also good for magic. It comes with some reveals, the back design's nice, it comes with a nice faces as well. But all around it's a very very nice deck and I'm surprised I like this one. Because um, I'm usually, you know what I mean guys, I'm usually like more of the other crazy decks. But this one really kind of grows on me. And I think to have it in your hands is probably better than seeing it on a video. 
But you know, check it out guys, it's such a nice deck to have to have in your collection as well. Now to pick up this deck, I'll leave the link in the description. Thanks Murphy's Magic for sending this. Check them out guys, such a great company. They've got a wide selection of decks, so definitely check it out and Magic obviously. But yeah, check out the last review guys as well by just clicking up there. Click subscribe just up there and click the previous video that up there and make sure you click like button just down there and subscribe just there. Now comment down below what you thought of this deck, give me your opinions, it will be very useful because you guys, it will be nice to know what you thought of the deck personally. You may disagree, I know some of you disagree with my um, what I say and obviously that's good because everyone has their own opinion but I would like to hear your opinion on this deck so would you pick it up and if so, if you have and you already own it, what's your opinion on the deck? That's it guys, you guys have a great day and I will see you for Deck War. That's it. Goodbye.